Hi, welcome to my channel Anam Takshasila. In this new video, I am going to solve a mathematical problem under vector product. So the problem is, find the unit vector perpendicular to each of the vectors 3i bar plus 3j bar plus k bar and 2i bar minus 5j bar plus 3k bar. So what they have given in the problem? In this problem, they have given two vectors. So first vector you have to take it as a bar and second vector you have to take it as b bar. So two vectors a bar and b bar are given. And what they are asking us to find? They are asking us to find the unit vector perpendicular to these two vectors a bar and b bar. So to solve this, you should remember a formula of unit vector that is n cap equal to a bar cross b bar by modulus of a bar cross b bar. So for this, what you do is you have to take vector product between a bar and b bar. That is, you need to find a bar cross b bar first. And then you have to take, after that you have to take the length of this a bar cross b bar. And then you have to substitute those in that formula to get the required solution. So step number one, you should write these. What they have vectors? First we have to take given. So two vectors I am writing. First uh, this vector I am taking as a bar and second one as b bar. So given a bar equal to 3a bar plus 3j bar plus k bar and b vector is 2i bar minus 5j bar plus 3k bar. So from this we will find first a bar cross b bar. So what is a bar cross b bar? Just put 3 cross determinant. So first row should be i bar, j bar, k bar and second row should be a bar elements. So what is a bar elements here? i bar quotient is 3, j bar quotient is 3, k bar quotient is 1. Now third row should be b bar elements. So i bar quotient is 2 here, j bar quotient is minus 5, k bar quotient is 3. So this is plus, minus, plus. So this will be i bar, so 3, minus 5, 1, 3, minus j bar, 3, 2, 1, 3, then plus k bar, that is 3, 3, 2, minus 5. So simplify this, you will get i bar into 3, 3 jar is what? 9. Here, 1, 5 jar is 5 and minus is there, so minus, minus, plus 5. So minus j bar into 3, 3 jar is 9, minus 2, 1 jar is 2, plus k bar into, what is k bar here? 3 into minus 5, that is minus 15, plus 2, 3 jar 6, so minus will be there, so minus 6. So now simplify this. So what is this? A bar cross B bar equal to? A bar cross B bar is, what is that? So I bar into 9 plus 5 means, that is 14, then minus J bar, so 9 minus 2, that is 7, plus K bar, that is minus 15 minus 6, that is minus 21. So you'll get A bar cross B bar is 14 I bar minus 7 J bar minus 21 K bar. Just put this in box. So after this what you do is take the length of this vector. That is magnitude of A bar cross B bar. So modulus of A bar cross B bar is square root of I bar portion is what? 14 square. J bar portion is minus 7 square. K bar portion is minus 21 square. So what is 14 square? 14 square is 196. Minus 7 square is 49. Here 21 square is 441. So add this. Now what is the value we will get? 196 plus 49 plus 441. You will get what is that? 6 plus 9, 15 plus 1, 16. Then uh, 1, 9, 10, 4, 8. So then you will get that is 686. So you are getting square root 686. Now next what you do? Therefore, what you need to find? That is unit vector. So we'll write in that formula. Therefore, unit vector is n cap equal to a bar cross b bar by modulus of a bar cross b bar. So what is a bar cross b bar? This no found. a bar cross b bar is 14 i bar minus 7 j bar minus 21 k bar by modulus of a bar cross b bar is root 686. So this is unit vector. So this is how we solve the above problem. Now if you want to solve more problems of this kind, I have given you a link in the description. Please click on that link. And this video is mostly useful to the polytechnic and engineering students. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel and Takshasila for further updates. Thank you for watching my video.